She's buried over here. Ron Mabel so knows these 10 acres in Columbia. No, that's not Lloyd Mifflin, that's John Houston. Better than anyone. From that post over there to the fence, this is the old brick cemetery here. As a volunteer at the Mount Bethel Cemetery for 20 years, his goal that's right. <laughs> is to somehow keep all of these people who have died alive. Yeah. Trying to. You're, ma you're making me tear up yeah, now. His passion is contagious. His off the top of his head knowledge. There are 14 Revolutionary War veterans in this section. Impressive. Many of the stories are passed from generation to generation, like this one, a man who was dying of rabies back in the 1700s when he carved his own headstone, knowing he was about to die. But others, they're still learning about today. This is the gentleman who was a German Hessian mercenary. I mean, I didn't know that up until three weeks ago. Oh, it's, it's like a light bulb going off. And he loves to share it. We won't go to all of them. But. A guided tour with him could go for hours. Now, for the first time, the cemetery has mapped the grounds so you can take a self-guided tour. Yeah, because we're not going to be here someday. <laughs> and me, probably not too far away, you know. But he won't be buried too far away either. In Lancaster County, Caitlin Smith, News 8.